As Angela Merkel's chief of staff, Ronald Pofala was a dealmaker and mediator. He reconciled disputes and competing interests among the cabinet ministers. He also coordinated the government's relations with the federal states and community groups. That was then. Now, just months after winning re-election as a member of parliament, Bofala is quitting. It looks like he may be taking a lobbying job at Deutsche Bahn as a board member. What a lobbyist does is try to persuade the government to do what his corporation wants. I think what makes this case also different is that he, Mr. Pofala is not only going to any company but to a public company where apparently this job was just created for him. So that arises the question how public companies are creating jobs for outgoing politicians. Pofala is not the first German politician to cause controversy with a career move. Shortly after Gerhard Schröder stopped being chancellor, he got a job at the Russian energy giant Gazprom. And former transport minister Matthias Wismann, on the right here, went on to head the auto industry association. Various NGOs slam such career moves, particularly the speed with which politicians cease to serve the people and start to serve big business.